Hello everyone, peace of Christ to all. Uh, uh, I saw the news about the missing airplane, which is an Egyptian airline. And this is Egypt airline. And here we see the update coming from the airline itself uh, just this morning in uh, Egypt. Now, until now they are saying, saying that this is a missing airplane. Uh, but if you look with me in the names here, or let's say uh, the citizenship count, uh, you will notice a few things which which is kind of make it fishy uh, first of all if a, uh, if an airplane is missing like at least you will hear a request of help from the captain there is no way uh, the airplane will disappear in a second unless there is an explosion or they've been forced to cut all their connection uh, by terrorist groups so either one is the reason but just like uh, if a, because even if an airplane is failing down they will have really uh, enough time to ask for help and request help because you know they, they fly in a very high uh, uh, from the ground and they will have time before they can get down uh, to say help us uh, so there is nothing no request um, no ask for help and that make it very fishy now if you look with me here you will see the the like uh, uh, the count of citizens, those who they are in the airplane. Uh, what I notice here, there is two Iraqi, and they are males, as I understand, and one Kuwaiti, and one Saudi, and one Sudani, and one Algerian. Now, two Iraqi are male, one Kuwaiti is male, one Saudi is male, one Sudani is male, one Algerian is male. There is no family. And sound very fishy for me. Now, there is 30 Egyptian. This is very normal because simply the flight is going from Paris to Egypt, to Cairo. And there is 15 French. And that's very normal too. But it doesn't make it sound normal for me that someone from Algeria is going to go to Cairo. You know, Algerian people, they go to Algeria when they go on vacation uh, especially even if they are like working in France or student student it doesn't make sense to go to Egypt same for someone from Sudan or uh, Saudi Arabia or Kuwait or Iraqi so uh, for me it sounds like very fishy I hope I'm wrong but 